Ben. I'm uh, 30 years old. I grew up in a Christian home in Lamarck, Manitoba. Uh, by the age of 13, I gave my life to Christ at uh, a pretty young age. I didn't really understand what it was to to really know Jesus. I just knew that's what our household kind of did. About the age of 19, uh, 19 or 20, I met my ex-girlfriend and me and her had a daughter together. And already at that point, I had been into a marijuana addiction. Uh, I was lying, I was stealing things so I could get what I felt like I needed at the time. I spiraled down a little farther, uh, got farther into my addiction and moved back home to my parents' place. Ended up meeting my wife and it turned out we started dating and I was still living a, uh, a drug addiction, uh, drug addicted lifestyle. Finally my wife kind of had enough of my nonsense too. My addiction got in the way of my children. So she kind of gave me an ultimatum to come to Teen Challenge and change my life so that I could still have a chance at being a good father, at being a good husband. I'm very thankful that she gave me that opportunity. So I came here to Teen Challenge. Didn't give the program much of a chance. I didn't care. I just wanted to be here to save my marriage. And I continued uh, kind of living kind of foolishly here at Teen Challenge, not taking the program seriously. In March um, 2015, I think it was March 27th or 28th, I made some poor choices and that led me to have to start the program over again. I decided to stay because I did still want a marriage. Uh, that was still the biggest reason why I stayed was to save my marriage. I love my kids, I love my wife. and. Uh, Finally, at some point, I decided I needed to take the program seriously. I needed to let God work in my life. And I'm so glad that I have because throughout the program, I got a chance to get to know some other guys from the program a little more closely. It was just a really good chance to, to bond with the guys and to be a part of something. And the fact that I stayed in the program and, and I'm now graduating, I don't feel like I'm a quitter. I, I feel like I can move on to other things. And when things get tough, I just persevere and God will give me the strength to get through it. And now it's... March 2016 and I'm graduating the program. Uh, God has been doing amazing, amazing works in my life. He's helped me bring my family back. He's helped me bring somewhat of a relationship back with my parents. It's something we're still working on, but, but to have my wife and kids back is something that means more to me than I could ever imagine. Uh, I just know that when things get tough, I know I can trust in God. God will give me the strength. I mean, doing the program here for 18 months, I mean, a lot of people say they look up to me and to me that's quite encouraging because I was never encouraging to anybody. I was just selfish and stupid and uh, it's only by the grace of God that that I stuck out the program for 18 months. Uh, I'm, I'm excited with how much strength I've gotten through it. I'm excited for what the future holds, supporting my family in any way I can, spending time with my children. I miss my kids. I miss spending time with them, dancing with them, jumping around with them. We just have a great time at home. I'm excited what God has for me. You're the reason we're here.